Hi guys, and welcome to Strength Universe. Before we start, I'd like to say thanks to Sanjesh and Wrestling King 2000 for suggesting a video on the infamous bodybuilder Victor Richards, who was born in Nigeria on the 15th of September 1964, before his family later moved to the United States where Victor grew up in San Diego, California. Victor stands 5 foot 10 inches tall and has stated that he was 145 kilograms or 320 pounds in shape but more on this later in the video. Victor's mother and father encouraged him to take up sports when he was a child. He started weight training at the age of 15 to improve his football, wrestling and track performance, at which stage he already weighed 95 kilograms or 210 pounds. At 17 years old, Victor started training in Gold's Gym on Venice Beach, where he was mentored by David and Peter Paul, who you may know as the Barbarian Brothers. Following eight months of preparation with the Barbarian Brothers, Victor had made significant improvements to his physique. Now tipping the scales at 225 pounds, he entered his first bodybuilding competition, the American Cup, which was held at the Shrine Auditorium in Los Angeles, where Victor won the teenage heavyweight class and finished second overall behind Rich Kaspari. Victor entered his second competition a few months later, now 18 years old and weighing 240 pounds, he competed at the Teenage Los Angeles contest, where he won the heavyweight division and overall title. Richards went on to compete again just two weeks later at the Orange County Muscle Classic, where he was beaten by a guy who placed fourth at the previous show. This experience brought Victor to the realisation that bodybuilding is a sport of politics and subjective judging. Weighing 245 pounds at the age of 19, Victor unexpectedly announced himself at the California Gold Cup, where he won the heavyweight and overall title. Victor first started to receive recognition around 1987, when he appeared in fitness magazines and was talked about as the biggest bodybuilder to have ever lived, at that point carrying a massive 300 pounds on his 5 foot 10 inch frame. In an interview given around this time, Richards claimed some absolutely incredible lifts, which include a shoulder press with a weight in the range of 204 kilograms or 450 pounds, barbell curls with up to 143 kilograms or 315 pounds, and a squat of nearly 408 kilograms or 900 pounds, all done without the use of a belt or knee wraps. As Victor held dual nationality of the United States and Nigeria, he decided to enter the 1992 Nigerian Championships, where he smashed the competition to win his pro card. This would ultimately be Victor's final competition. Although he continued to train and at his peak in the mid to late 1990s, he was reported to weigh 168 kilograms or 370 pounds, with a chest that measured 67 inches, biceps of 26 inches, and 36 inch thighs. In fact, when accounting for his average stature, Richards may be considered as one of the most densely muscled bodybuilders of all time. Further claims of his strength were made by Victor himself in an interview given to MuscleSportsMag.com in March 2015, when he stated that he was squatting around 408 kilograms or 900 pounds for two reps, did hat squats of 6 to 700 pounds for 15 to 20 reps, and was bench pressing 295 kilograms or 650 pounds for five reps. It was during a 2018 vlog for the Iron Mag Labs YouTube channel that Greg Valentino made the following claim. Wait, I personally spotted him. He was using two 250 pound dumbbells for inclined flies. I spotted him. I saw it. I didn't even know they made dumbbells that high. That's, that's 500 fucking pounds. In my opinion, such a lift would be impossible and I believe that Greg actually meant a dumbbell press as opposed to a fly. There is no doubt that Victor Richards was by any standards a huge bodybuilder with huge strength. However, given that he never competed as or against professional bodybuilders, I don't buy into the claims that he was an uncrowned Mr. Olympia. But I would like to know your opinion on the subject, so please leave a comment below. I've left credits and my social media links in the description below so please check those out and give them a follow. And finally, if you enjoyed the video, please help to support my channel by smashing like, sharing the video, and if you haven't done so already, by subscribing. Thank you.